Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. I'm Olski and today we're gonna take a little look at some scary videos, some paranormal videos, some something. Hopefully get us a bit spooked, that would be pretty nice. But yeah, it's been a little while, I'm sorry for the delay on the new video, but I'm here now, so it's all good. But yeah, the video today is 5 scary ghost videos you can't take your eyes off by Depths of Despair. So that sounds pretty interesting and I'm very hyped to take a little look because it's been a while now, it's about a week since I watched something scary, so yeah. But before we start, of course, in the description you have a link to his channel, go in there and subscribe to his channel and while you're going down there, on the road, you know, you can take a little pit stop at the subscribe button down here and click that, that would be very nice. So yeah, but now, let's begin. Stay in your room. Hey, I will. Three friends are home alone at night when something terrifying happens that prompts one of them to call their mum. Okay, um... You know it's bad when you have to call your mum. Then you know shit is going down. You're upstairs in your room? Yeah, yeah, we're up, we're, where am my room right now? Okay, make sure you lock the door then. Um, I'm gonna come home, I should be home in about 10 minutes. I need you to stay calm though, okay? Okay. Right. So calm, quiet, keep the door locked. Alright, do not go out of the room whatsoever. I'm gonna come home, I'll be there in 10 minutes. Okay. And then um, I'm gonna call the cops on the way home too. Just the to cops? Sure no, mom, but why do we have to get the cops? We're going to just make sure everybody's safe and they can get there faster than I can. The What's going on there? are locked in a bedroom upstairs and have been instructed by their mom to stay in the room no matter what until the police arrive. Earlier, they heard loud banging as well as glass shattering coming from all over downstairs. They thought most likely there was an intruder, and that's why uh -oh. the boy's mum didn't want to take any chances and called the police just to be safe. Oh shit! Glass, was it metal? What, what did it sound like? It was just like a, a big thud, and then, and then like glass shattering. But after that, we just like the police came and stared So you heard glass shatter? Yeah. After questioning the boys, the police did a thorough search of the property and found no signs of a break-in, nor was there anyone outside lurking nearby. Okay, you know what? Without context, this is actually creepy shit. I don't know what's going on here, but it seems to be very serious. And many cops seems pretty real. So yeah, it seems legit. Making this case all the more strange. Yes. However, while they were waiting for the police to arrive, the boys grew impatient and decided to search the house themselves. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'll see you soon. I love you. Uh, I love you too. Bye-bye. Bye. Pajama squad, rise up! What's going on here? Dude. Don't split it up. Biggest mistake in every horror movie. Don't split it up. Okay, I mean, can we get some light here, please? <laughs> One of the friends claims he saw something move in the dark, causing them all to retreat back to their room. Whatever it may be, it wasn't seen on camera, but after re-watching the video later on, one of them noticed this. Okay. Watch closely. Oh, yeah. What? Something can be seen behind the railings in front oh, shit. just swiftly moving across, almost as if hovering. And if you look closely, it clearly looks like a pale white face just hovering. The way it moves with such speed without making a Okay, okay now it's impossible. Okay. Little I mean more 
Yeah, mine is impossible to see now. But I think it's more likely that it's a hand now than a head. Looks like someone is like touching these bars or whatever it's called with their hand. Not really. It doesn't really look like a face. But I don't know. Making a sound has left the friends convinced that it's a ghost and was responsible hand, for no? the earlier commotion. But as always, let me know what you think. Okay, I mean, that seemed. Uh, that was actually really creepy and it seemed very legit. So I don't know. But I think we all have been through. Been through that type of ripple effect, you know, when one of your friends shit their pants starts running, everyone starts running, and you could hear the guy in the back asking, Why are we running? I mean, I think we have all been in that position once or twice. I mean, that was pretty fun, I guess. Alone. It's late one night on July 25th of 2024, and Oi. a girl named Celeste is home alone, locked in her bedroom. Pero me da, me, ya me da miedo ir a grabar, la verdad. ¿Qué? Okay. Pero si estoy acostada aquí, literal no hay nadie. No sé qué voy a hacer, me da miedo ir a ver. Yo creo que me va a parar a ver. Me da miedo, me da miedo, me da miedo. ¿O qué? Oh, madre. <laughs> Ni modo. Hello? No mames, no mames. What? Eso no estaba tirado ahorita. El cereal se supone que estaba ahí arriba. Oy. No mames, la neta, no mames. No, 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 vete a la verga. Vete a la verga, vete a la verga. She's afraid to leave her bedroom, and for very good reason. Her family have gone away for a few nights. So she has been home alone for the last three nights. And each time while asleep, she is abruptly woken up by loud banging sounds coming from around the house. Uh -oh. From things like objects being moved to doors opening and closing, and even footsteps. Eventually, she musters the courage to search the house and finds nothing there. But as she returns back to her bed, she starts to hear the same noises again. Feeling frightened, she decides to turn on the lights around the house and sets up a camera to record the area where the most sound is coming from. Okay, we're going to put the camera here. Here, 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 Los creo que no sé qué hacer ya. Me da mucho miedo, please. Me da mucho miedo ver lo que hay. No mames. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Vamos a ver. Yes. Voy a armar de valor y vamos a ver. That's a loud bridge. She looks around one last time and sees nothing strange. Then she proceeds to watch the recorded footage and instantly runs out of the house, terrified. Okay. <laughs> No mames, no uh -oh. mames, no mames, no mames, no mames, no mames, no Me está dando miedo, te lo juro que estoy temblando I don't trust you, that's right Ay, what, no what, mames. ay No mames, no mames, no mames, no mames Me estoy muriendo de miedo, estoy What? Estoy aquí, afuera de la casa, me da miedo me da miedo, me da miedo meterme ya. No sé qué hacer, no sé qué hacer, plebes. Estoy. Plebes, si me tocaran el corazón, me estoy muriendo. An object can be seen falling off the table by itself, 
and then shortly afterwards a dark oh, figure can be seen peeking out towards the camera. Celeste oh, so, oh. is understandably terrified okay. and runs out of the house and quickly calls the police. Like the previous video, the police search the property and find no signs of anybody there. Just what exactly did Celeste see? Hopefully oh, that's creepy as shit. Okay, I missed it the first time. Whoops, my bad. It has a big head. You can get a very big head with a lot of hair. Tiny eyes. I mean, it seems like he got no forehead. Or he just rocking the... The potty haircut. Okay, oh. oh. Okay, wow. I mean, the sound got me, but I didn't notice the face at first. Okay, oh, Hopefully that's a bit crazy. Some more updates Sorry for cursing. Okay, cinema. that was really good. Two guys were working in a cinema cleaning the room as they prepared to lock up and head home for the night. When suddenly, they hear some knocking sounds coming from within the building. Not sure what to make of this, one of the workers gets his phone out and begins to record as they attempt to recreate the sound and see where it's coming from. This is what he captures. Okay. Oh, we're running very fast here. Shit. We got a little peek a boom piece of shit again. Something was in the projector room, but the two employees stated that they were on the closing shift and there shouldn't be anyone else around. On another night, while searching the area, making sure everything is in order before closing up again. Wait, wait, wait. I just gotta make sure. Did you even see it? Okay, you did, you did. It's fine, it's fine. On another night, while searching the area, making sure everything is in order before closing up again, he sees something chilling. Watch closely. What's on the screen? What? Is someone st- Uh oh. Can you turn off the lights? We're crazy. A creepy pale face can be seen watching the employee from the darkness oh, shit. above. Is it a real ghost responsible for the knocking sounds? Or is it all just an intricate ruse? You Oi. judge. Okay, we got a lot of uh, pale-faced peekabooers, I guess. I missed that as well, but I mean, it wasn't a... We go back a little bit here. Investigate. Isn't someone standing there as well? I'm pretty sure, no? Uh, someone is standing there. I guess we missed that part. Okay. I mean, it was also really good. The implants. Or is it huh. just an intricate ruse? No, you it should judge. be. Alone. The full I mean, so far, these clips have actually been pretty creepy. Uh, all three seem pretty legit. Could be fake, obviously. Always. But, I don't know. Something fishy comes going from on an there. employee who works at a convenience store. While working alone late in the evening one day, he started to hear some strange reoccurring sounds coming from the store warehouse. Feeling scared as he is alone, he decides to try and record it as he hesitates to go and check it out. Take a look. Tengo rato escuchando un ruido aquí en mi trabajo. En la bodega. Y estoy solo. Y quería grabar a ver si... No sé, tengo mucho miedo. I mean, if you're all... I don't want to be that guy, but if you're all alone... 
Why? Who's the mask for? I mean, I guess if a customer comes in, he want to be prepared, but... I mean, you don't want to get some fresh air, I guess. No, 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 no me había pasado algo así, como de algo de sustos o algo. Pero tengo rato escuchando eso. No me animo a ir para allá, güey. Let's do it anyway. Content, bro. Content. Después de un rato me animo a ver, güey. Tengo mucho miedo, güey, la neta. Nunca me había pasado algo así, güey. Uh oh. Fui yo. A mi edad, que lo vine, obviamente. Creo que la moví con la camisa. Ya. Yeah. Tengo un rato que escucho yo cosas. Mucho miedo, mucho miedo me da, güey. Is it gonna be another little peeking piece of ass? O sea, güey, checa esa pinche luz, güey. ¿Tú crees que aquí tengo ganas de subir ahí arriba? No. ¿Tú crees que tengo ganas de subir ahí arriba? No. Pedo. Wey, esto parece película de terror, güey. Mhm. Mm sí, eh. Oh, something's gonna be again. Lo bueno es que tengo este foco, güey. Y acá arriba, por ejemplo, tengo. Acá me da miedo a veces que siento que me, que me están viendo, güey. Ya me prendo el pinche foco, güey. Oh shit! No, <laughs> What do you mean? You, someone just ran in, stole the light bulb, and went out. I, I don't know. Tengo un chingo de miedo, wey. Oh. Oh. Wow. Tengo un chingo de miedo, wey. Yeah, we're on the edge now. Oh god. Hello? Deja prender la lámpara, güey. Se la verga. No se ve nada, güey. Uh, oy, 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 oy. Oh, madre, güey. Oy. A la verga, güey. A la verga. The moment he gets there, mm. looks up, the lights above immediately start flickering. And then at the top, an object drops on its own, scaring him away. Clearly, someone or something was lurking at the top of the warehouse area. In another video, a man named Carlos lives alone right next to a cemetery, which is literally outside his backyard. He didn't oh. think much of it at first, but one night he starts experiencing creepy stuff while alone at home. This is what he captured. Oh, God, I mean, I'm, I'm starting to feel that I'm kind of riling myself up. I, I'm on the, I'm a bit on the edge, so I kind of, I'm kind of scaring myself right now. But I, I mean, it's been pretty creepy as well. I mean, this, this is good. Mi gente, miren, me encuentro en mi casa. Miren, miren que no hay absolutamente nada. Y me encuentro como, como medio raro. No sé qué es lo que está pasando. Okay, that's Pero crazy. Pero en verdad. No sé qué es lo que está pasando, mi gente, en mi casa hoy. ¡Uy! Miren, señores, miren. Me siento como... Como que no sé, como que hay algo raro en mi, en mi habitación hoy. Ok, la feel like the music doesn't really fit right now, but <laughs> ok. I mean, would you be able to live like that? I, I don't know. You know, you go out for morning smoke. And you can see a lot of graves. That, that's pretty nuts. Por favor. Necesito que me ayuden, hoy sí. Hoy siento esto, miren, estoy solo en mi casa. Miren, estoy solo en mi casa, papá Dios. Y siento como que se mueve toda la oh, cosa. Wow. Oh, Dios mío, se apagó la luz. Necesito a alguien que me ayude. Oh, Dios mío. Señores, please, por favor, relax. ¿Quién está viendo esto? 
Por favor, compártanlo. Miren, estoy solo oy, en oy. la habitación. Pero siento como... Como no sé, como que se caen las cosas. Uy. Oh, papá Dios. Señores, miren. Miren. Es tiempo de run, ¿no? La sangre de Cristo tiene poder. La sangre de Cristo tiene poder, señores. Hoy. Recuerden que me encuentro aquí en mi casa, mi gente, en el cementerio, Cristo Redentor. Ah, uh, no, es precursor, actually. Objects can be seen falling all over the place. And as he pans around, there's nobody in the room. But as soon as he goes outside the door, you can see the cemetery right outside his house. Perhaps that is the reason for all of this. No, Maybe but I guess so, yeah. If you have any video. Okay, I mean, oh, wow, that's super bright. Hello there. Super, super white man here. But okay, I, I don't know, that, that was pretty crazy. I'm not gonna lie. The music in the background kind of made it seem a bit more fun than it maybe should have. I don't know. But the camera work was also pretty crazy. It was just spinning around, managed to point at every direction in a couple of seconds. I mean, it was good. It was good. Astral projection. One night, a man was astral projecting from his bed around 1 a.m. What's For that? For those who don't know, astral oh, projection is a term used to describe an intentional out-of-body experience huh? where one's consciousness can leave the physical body and experience things through the astral plane. However, there are some What? warnings of this practice, and some people say that you can be vulnerable in this state, and entities in the astral plane can target you. The man in the video explains that he does this practice often, but on this particular night, he says as he was astral projecting up his stairs, something knocked him back out of it, and ever since then he has been hearing strange knocking sounds inside his house, so he gets his phone out to record it. Take a look. It's about 1 a.m. and uh, I was actually projecting. Okay. Um, uh -huh. I normally do this often, but this time, as I was walking up the stairs, something like knocked me back out. And ever since then, I've been hearing knocking noises. Like, do you, do you hear that? I'm just recording mm. it because I don't know what's going on. It's like kind of weird. Hello? Hello? Anyone here? Hello? I'm here. Hello? Oh, wow. We are turning so slow. Anyone here? Mm. Oh! A strange sound can be heard, and the door behind him slams shut on its own. Upon realizing this, he gets frightened and quickly ends the video abruptly. Shortly afterwards, he checks his room and finds nothing there, and then he goes downstairs and begins to feel like he's not alone. So he starts to record once again. Okay. Oh, that's a very nice kitchen, actually. It's nice. There's no door open here, right? I don't know. Oh, whoa. The lights on the ceiling are swaying, and as he looks towards the blinds, they begin to move aggressively. And at that moment, he runs upstairs and immediately packs his things to go stay at a hotel for a few nights. Could it be that by astral projecting, this man unknowingly allowed something into his home? I'm curious to see what you think. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, the, the, mm, that was a bit trippy. I mean, a part of my brain says fake as shit. Because, I mean, the strange sound, the sound effect like that sounded incredibly fake. Uh, but I don't know, the door slamming and everything like that seemed a bit legit, I guess. But I think I'm gonna call it fake. I don't know. It, just seemed very fake. So I don't know. What do you think? Oops. Bonus. Oh, bonus. Thank you. 
A mother named Susan was told something quite worrying by her two-year-old daughter. The girl said that someone was hiding inside her closet. Concerned uh -oh. for her daughter after hearing this, she quickly heads over to investigate the closet. My daughter has informed me that there is a person in her closet that keeps smiling at her. And someone is in my left ear now. There's a person? Yeah. Can you show me where the person is? Right here. Right here. Right here. Is it, is it Elsa? No. No. No? I'm scared. You're scared? Yeah. Okay. Is there, can you show me where the person is? Um. Is it a, is it a, is it a kid person or a grown up person? Grown up person. It's a grown up oh, yeah. person? The worst kind. You want to wear your Elmo costume? Yeah. Okay. There's a grown-up <laughs> person in your closet? Yeah. And it's right there? Yeah. It's my closet. It's yeah. your closet. Say, go away, person. <laughs> you fuck off. I'm scared. You're scared? Yeah. I'm a person. Okay. Well, we'll get rid of the person. The little girl is completely Ooh, wow. terrified by something unseen inside her closet. Ooh. She seems quite convinced that someone is inside there. In a follow-up video, she removes everything that could resemble a person or create any shadows. And the girl still says there's someone in there. Um, it's still there. Okay, we're back in the left there. Uh, I didn't see it at first because, well, before I record, the first time she came in and told me that, um, I asked her if it was Elsa on the box and she said no not the box and she specified to the space next to the box So I didn't think it was and I didn't know what people were talking about then I saw it um, There is like a woman shaped thing on the box, which is very strange um, So I take the box out I took all the clothes out of that in case that was like causing a shadow or something So I took all the clothes out of the back of that closet. I took the box out um, and she still saw the person oh, someone's at my door she still uh -oh. saw the person. She said that they're still there and they're still smiling at her. Just what did the girl see in there? Cases like this occur often. And a lot of the time, parents don't believe their child until they see the evidence for themselves. Even though nothing could be seen in this closet, Susan decided to lock it to give her daughter peace of mind. And she hasn't been Good. scared ever since. Subscribe and hit okay. that bell icon. And that was also... Oh wow, we super white again. Whoops. Okay, that's it. And the last clip was also creepy. Uh, creepy, very creepy. Just super creepy. I mean, like I've said before, it's always extra creepy when a kid says that they see something weird. Because obviously it could be their imagination or something like that. But I don't see a reason why they would lie either. So it's always creepy when I see clips like that. So yeah, but I think the video overall was really good. A lot of creepy clips. I got a bit sweaty here. So yeah, I enjoyed it. And if you did as well, link in the description to the channel. You can go in there and uh, check some other videos out. And if you like this reaction here, uh, I will, if you could subscribe to my channel, it would make me very happy. But uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.